This is how we hunt for crawdads here in the south. Right. So far, that's all we found. Just a few spots. Hey guys, Capper here, and welcome to today's video of a pond dam repair. This was supposed to be an easy one, a gimme, because we knew where the entrance was of the leak and the exit was, and it was a really good sized leak that was gushing. So in theory, it should have been really easy to find a tunnel in the dam and plug it. But of course it wasn't. So let's see how this one goes. Definitely stay tuned. And don't forget, if you enjoy our content, please help us out. And please like it and comment and share it for us. Because you guys are the only ones that can help us grow with the mysterious YouTube algorithm. So let's go have some fun on the machines and see how this one goes. Thanks a lot. Here's a look at John's setup. I won't hold it against you, John, that you got the Dodge, but you got a Cummins. That's nice. I think this is a... Uh, it's a 50 model, but he said it's a 39 horse. But I'm sure she's gonna dig. Beautiful. All right, so uh, step number one, let's see if I can get a little better angle. We're making a borrow pit, so he's gonna peel the, uh, the good dirt off, pile that, and once we hit clay, then we're gonna pile that and I'll bring that with the uh, skid steer. That Yanmar is pretty quiet. Man, that thing looks like it has a longer reach than the, uh, the Bobcat that I've got. Hard to say just by looking. Okay, so the original audio is not really that good in here. Uh, we were operating it with the cab open and stuff so you could hear the engine just a little bit more. But basically I'm giving it a try, the Anmar, it's a 39 horse engine. Basically the same size as my Bobcat E42, they're about the exact same size machines. So we're going to just finish up this borrow pit, get a nice uh, big uh, hill of clay so we can repack the dam once we dig it open. And if he wants to use the black dirt somewhere else, we can move it that way. So we'll finish up and get up on the dam and get started. So there's the entrance hole. Uh, I got John all briefed up on, on the dig here, and we're gonna start digging. We're gonna we're gonna peel back basically probably gonna be around to mid mid dam, maybe. It also depends on how sharp the hole goes down. Because once we can't reach the hole anymore, then we're not gonna go any deeper. Um, I have found that you really only need a few feet of good compacted dirt to, to cure a leak like this, but I'm hoping we're going to get a solid uh, 10, 12 feet of plug, if you will, I guess.
So we switched off on the uh, excavator, but right from the get-go, I was kind of concerned that we just couldn't find a really big hole here because that water was gushing through. So let me show you a quick example of one of the previous leaks that I fixed where you can clearly tell where the leak is coming from. So this is a one we did on one of our ponds. You can clearly see you hit the leak, but you see the big cavern in there and other ones that we found you can have big caverns in there. But this is what we couldn't really find in this pond dam. We couldn't find a big cavern. It was just a series of little two inch holes that were made by crayfish. convinced we've got the tunnel um, but we're finding a lot of these holes that look perfectly round but they could be crawdad holes of course they're all full of water so the entrance hole is right here that's uh, where it's coming in the pond at so now we're gonna move back a little farther we're gonna dig deeper and we're gonna dig wider but you're gonna see that I never found a really good clear hole in this dam. So the only possibility if we actually missed it is that that leak went literally straight down, down into the base of that pond dam. But let's keep working and see if we could find something else because we do find some other pockets that had water in them. This is how we hunt for crawdads here in the south. Right. So far, that's all we found. Just a few spots. See anything on that side? Might be able to plug it from here. It's just I, I feel better seeing it. Right. Seeing it. I don't see anything else running out back that way. No, I might go that way 
just a little more, and then we might start back. Okay. Bigger hole. 